Hello guys, this is Farzad Shahbande from visualcomputer.net. Welcome to the first lesson of my more advanced drone programming course. Uh, here you will learn how to program your drone. I will use the DJI Tello as you see it here, and I will use Python and OpenCV to program it. I also use Kiwi to create a GUI graphical user interface to contact with your drone. Because I love NVIDIA Jetson AGX Xavier, I use this development kit for my job. There are some differences between this course and other courses that you can download from YouTube. For example, the first one is face recognition is used here. Most of the programs out there use face detection uh, for this uh, kind of courses. But I used face recognition. It means that at first you uh, learn some uh, pictures, some faces to the drone and it will track that specific picture and draw and, uh, and follow that. Uh, it means that if you give it your, uh, your face, it will only track you, nobody else. And I also used Kiwi to create a graphical user interface. Let me explain it more to you. As you see here, this is a, a graphical user interface I made for my job. It has some buttons here. And the picture is above them. For example, this button, if you touch it, uh, the takeoff will occur. And also the battery, the battery level is reported here every second. Frame per second is also reported here. The height of the drone and the detected person's name is written here. I create a button here for landing. It means when you want to uh, land the drone, you do not need to touch the queue, for example, on the keyboard. It has a, a, a button here to touch and the drone will land. And here my face is detected uh, and the name is over it and also uh, a rectangle, which is very fancy is drawn over it. The second difference is that I used AI-based tracker for my job. What is it meaning? Suppose uh, the drone is detected me. It locked on my face. What if I turn back my head? There is no face for it to track, so it will lose you. But by a very advanced procedure, I tracked uh, the face. And uh, even if you turn your head, it will follows you and knows you. And when you uh, turn uh, another time your face, it will uh, another time detect you. The colors are different. I made uh, different colors for them to recognize the tracking mode or the detection mode. Here, the detection mode is not done. It is tracking mode. And uh, uh, the last uh, difference is that I use Jetson AGX Xavier. It has a very strong GPU and uh, the flight will be very easily done. The image processing will be done very well. And uh, I very love this uh, development kit. Uh, in order to show you what you are going to have at the end of this course, I recorded a movie. Uh, I will explain, uh, explain, it, um, explain it for you over the movie. And you can see uh, what will have uh, what will we have at the end of this course? Okay, this is the move.
I touched the uh, takeoff button. It is uh, the blue one here. It goes up, finds me, and follow me. Follow my face. Whenever I go, it goes with me. Sometimes in the uh, bottom left uh, picture, uh, you see that it is written tracking. This is when it tracks me and it cannot see my face. Look here. Uh -huh. I go down, it goes down with me. Go up, goes up with me. Move with me. Turn with me. Know me from the back. I touched the landing and it landed. Okay. We are going to uh, write the Python code during this uh, course with each other. And uh, I will describe you the Kiwi, the face recognition, the tracker, and everything that is needed step by step to you. Uh, my course has another uh, difference with others that it's, it is completely free. Hope to see you soon. Bye.